Hey guys, this is HP LaserJet Pro MFB3102 FDWE to scan double sided with this printer. Okay, using ADF is what I want us to do. So stick the document you want to scan, okay, on the scanner ADF feeder. Okay, go to the scan, select scan, okay, and select go to the scan setting paper size okay is automatic and source is document feeder resolution is 200 you can select the resolution 300 dpi okay and color is black and white okay now this is lesser so you can only this with this printer now is can only print black and white okay so do, then go back okay if it's photo you want to scan select photo but this is document select scan Okay, and it's scanning. Okay, and you can see the document scan. The next we need to do is with this document we scan now. Okay, so stick the doc the size you want to scan facing up. So we want to scan this back. Okay, so put it inside. Okay, for you to be able to scan the other side, click add. Okay, click scan. Okay, can see this is the front and back scan. Okay, so this is how to scan double sided. Okay, now so this is the document we scan. What you need to do now to print it out, select print. Okay, and make sure you select double sided. Okay, and paper size is A4. Okay, and if you want more option, then you select more option for you to make sure the quality, you can select best quality, okay, and tray source is tray one, paper type is plain paper, and fit to page, okay, and plain paper. If it's photo, then you select photo gloss paper, okay, then you go back and click print. So this document now is going to print out double-sided, and this is the original one, Okay, we scan. Here we go. So this is the document we scan. You can see front and back. So this is how to for you to scan the document double-sided with this printer. Okay, but you need to make sure you bring it out and turn it turn the other side. Okay, so you can do this manually. Okay, to for you to scan double-sided. Sided. So this is this is the document to scan double sided and printed it printed it out. This is the original one here. Okay. So this is exactly uh, how to do this. I hope it makes sense to you. This document to scan now. If you want to share this document to somebody, you just need to select share or save it. So this document now. Okay. We need to select PDF, basic PDF, which is usually for document. If you are scanning image, then you need to change it to to jpj okay so now this is pdf and language is english document size is 0 0.4 is the document size okay now the next you need to do is select share it give you option for you to share this okay via several platform this is email whatsapp or or print or message so i'm going to share this through email okay so this document now is attached to my email. So type the email address of the person you want to send this to. I'm going to send it to myself. Okay. Then put the subject high. Okay. And type the message. Click send. So this document now is sent to my inbox. Remember, so what, what we have done is double-sided scan. Okay. We printed it out. We share this now document to my inbox. I also want to show you, show you how to save this document to your phone. So the next you need to do is click save. So this document now, and also make sure you change the format to basic PDF if it's doc document and click save. So this document now is going to save. So save it on the file, click save. Okay, and this save on my file. 
okay now what you want to do is you can go back to my inbox to check if this document arrived on my email in my email address so i'm going now to check my email okay here we go it just arrived okay so the document just arrived note to self click it open okay and download it okay this is the document we scan remember it's two pages but when we are printing it out we printed it out double-sided okay we scan it so you manually scan it and printed it out double-sided I also want to show you the same procedure how to scan okay using the printer scanner okay double-sided as well so this printer now okay this is the document you want to scan for instance stick it on the scanner okay close it now go to the app go to HP smart app okay go to HP smart app go to home page okay this is the HP Smart App, okay. Now go to scan, okay. Now change it from the source, okay. Instead of doc instead of document feeder, change it to glass scanner, okay. Change it to glass scanner, okay. And once you change it, you see a good mark. Now go back, okay. Resolution, okay. Maximum is 300 dpi. So at the moment it's on 200 dpi. So if you want to increase it more, you can change it to maximum. It can be it's 300 dpi. Okay. And the color is black and white and the paper size is A4 paper. So if you are scanning letter 5 by 7 or 4 by 6 or 3.5, you just need to select particular okay page size. So at the moment it's an A4 paper. Okay. Then go back. Then if you go back, the next thing you need to do is click. If you are scanning document, if document, if you are scanning photo, select photo, select scan, and this document now is scanning. This is very quick, okay? Now, the other thing you need to do, you need to make sure you adjust the boundary, okay, to full page, okay? So the boundary is full, okay? Now, the other thing we need to do is click next, okay? and to scan the other page okay open it up okay if you want to scan another another document maybe the other side if it's document that is something is written at the back then you put it okay face down so i'm going to give, put another document this one okay so if it's document that the okay that is got front and back so you turn the other side okay once you finish this side turn, the, turn it manually use your hand and change it then the next you need to do is click add go to add on your on the app do, do the same thing click scan and it start to scan the beauty of this printer is very quick okay and also make sure you adjust the boundary to full so that you can capture all the image if you don't do this okay you will not get the whole image so make sure you always adjust the boundary to full and click next okay so this is the doc document now we scan this is the first one and this is the second one now okay to print it out double-sided select print remember if it's a printer that you can print color okay you need to select color mode but with this printer you can only print black and white so but make sure keep an eye on the color mode if you are printing color okay to print double-sided Okay, select double-sided long edge or short edge. I usually print double-sided long edge. And if you are printing more than one copies, then you need to increase the number for the copies. Okay, and also if you want to private pick and paper size, make sure you change it to A4. Okay, and you change to A4. And the orientation, if you want, you change it to automatic or landscape. Depending on paper you have, I want to have it portrait. Okay, so now you can also see the image okay what it looks like okay see what whether, whether you're happy with it and once you're done the next thing you need to do is just hit go ahead and hit the scan button and it's printing it out here we go So this is the document now we scan, 
okay we scan two pages you remember we scanned the first one bring another and brought another one and scan it we're printing it out we printed it out double-sided to save paper okay so if you're happy with this process please do consider to subscribe it help the channel this is how to scan your document okay double-sided using adf and also double-sided using the printer scanner and print it out likewise you can share this document now or send it to any person okay thank you very much indeed appreciate you thank you please like share and subscribe it helps the channel thank you peace